so I'm hoping we see the legendaries. Uh, I don't know, maybe it'll tell us a little bit about the region or whatever. The new Pokemon games taking place in. I just remember not really liking the, uh, the, <laughs> the character models. Like, they just look like very, very young children. Which, I mean, obviously the player character in Pokemon always is, but they, like... This doesn't look right for some reason. It doesn't really... <laughs> it just looks weird. There it is. There it is. Second trailer. It's just called a second trailer. You ready, everybody? Here it is. Oh, man. Is that 3D models of the uh, starters? Here we go. It's time already. Okay. The stupid... I don't like the... <laughs> I don't like those characters. They're kind of weird. Low res. <laughs> Very low res. Is that me? <laughs> uh. <laughs> oh, look at that! Look at them! Look at the... Okay. Okay. You know what? This is... This is... It's, it's, it, it doesn't feel like much, but I feel like these, I feel like these little guys have a little more detail to them than usual Pokemon models. All right. There's like some, there's like some shading going on. <laughs> okay. What's that little thing? You don't want me to pause? It's a fake Pikachu. It's the it's the fake Pikachu of this generation. <laughs> I'm calling it now. Oh, and there's an actual Pikachu. Look at these look at the shading. I feel like that's that's new for Pokemon. Is that a regional Badu? Or is this something else? What is that? What is that little guy? LeChonk? LeChonk? You're kidding me. LeChonk? Okay, I know this guy. Oh, the Pokemon Center is like a kiosk out in the wild. Got a trade. A little Larvitar and a, ooh, a Venonat. Oh, oh, Colossal! Colossal's in the game! Oh, thank God. Colossal's in the game. Oh, so happy. I love Colossus, my favorite Pokemon from Gen 8. Not actual game footage, yeah, no shit. No shit, huh? <laughs> what the fuck? Are these the legendaries? Oh my god. Sheesh! Oh, look at these, look at these folks. God damn, what is this, Monster Hunter? Ooh. Ooh. Oh my god. Look, look at the Adam's apple on these fellas. What the heck? Okay, this is the cover. Is that the cover art? That's pretty cool. Okay, you know what? Can I just appreciate that it's actually like a an artistic, like drawn for art compared to the fucking just like like 3d model they just threw on there this is and it's got a cool background a little kind of like a little reflection scaly background um really cool i pr i so much prefer this to like just like throw in a 3d model of the legendary on the cover and just like being done uh yeah which one to get which one to get i feel like i'm more drawn to scarlet but i don't know digital pre-order is now available why 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 pre-order so my friend just texted me co-op co-op was, was there a co-op section <laughs> okay, let's let's watch again 
What, what, what is that? What is this? Is this just like a thing saying Pokemon Company? <laughs> that was, I feel like that was weirdly placed. Let's try this again. Okay, suit up in your little uh, USPS delivery outfit. Time to analyze. Okay, the big open <laughs> Sonic Frontiers land. These, okay, are these the two professors here? Professor Sada? Professor Turo. So, people are saying that the, this that this place seems like it's, um... Seems like it's kind of based off of, like, uh... Spain, maybe? Okay, let's take a look at these, these little... Squirts here. Okay. Um... Uh, f uh, Foy Coco. I think I think I'm still pulling toward. I think I'm still leaning towards this guy. Was this guy Quaxley or something? Was that Quaxley? And then uh, Sprigatado. Sprigatado. Is that it? Um, yeah, they look good. The models look good. It's it's like I feel like they just got more to them than the last generation. Like there's like some texture. There's like some texture. You probably can't really see it through the stream, but like, you know, it kind of looks like a little kind of fuzzy there. It has like some, some, it's not just like plasticky. Uh, the, sh the shadows look okay, you know? If I get both games, I'll get Quaxley in the other. I, I, I was hoping we'd get to see maybe like an evolution, but I, I, they're probably gonna hold that till till it like right when it like comes out or whatever. It'll get leaked anyway. God, this game is pretty low res, but that's that's all right. I don't really care about that. <laughs> Wish they would upgrade the switch. Okay, do they, they show a little glimpse of the? Because uh, in Gen Eight, they kind of gave the the starters personalities. <laughs> And you get to hear their cries, I guess. Are you these three's trainer? Who's who's that? Okay, a fake Pikachu for the generation. Power of science is there's always a guy that says the power of science is amazing. They why'd they even throw that into the trailer? If you connect with friends, you can head out on adventure. Oh, that's why they put it in. On adventures together, up to four of you at a time. Okay, so maybe I don't want to get my hopes up that it's like, oh, full co-op. Um, oh, you think that person before was the rival? Maybe. Um, so maybe it's like while you're outside of the cities or something or not doing kind of like plot points. Then you can like explore with your friends or whatever, which is a step up from um, fucking Sword and Shield, where you just see random people and they pr pretend that they were there was other people in the wild area with you, but it was just like random character models f moving from spot to spot, like a wild area type thing. Yeah, except this is supposed to be fully open, like you just kind of walk. You're like the whole place is open, and you kind of like walk into the towns and stuff, like from from the whole open area. I guess. Um, so yeah, I guess there's some kind of element of co-op exploring. Up to four at a time, that's pretty good, that's pretty good. Wow, I just assumed this was some part of the game, like the these are your little buddies, your little NPC buddies, but no, I guess this is you meeting up with your friends. Okay. Cool customizations for your character, it looks like. You get to customize your child character however you want. Okay. I, that's got to be a regional Badu, right? Sprigatito looks so tiny. They're all pretty tiny, aren't they? As long as you see them out in the Pokeball. I kind of wish we'd be an adult character. Yeah, I know, right? I don't, how, can, can we remove the fucking collar and tie? How soon can we get rid of that nonsense? I'm not walking around with a collar and a tie. I, I Lechonk, great addition. 
Big fan of LeChonk. <laughs> Gonna have to pick one up. A but don't. True. I got enough with the ties and the collars. No. Kind of looks like a charger bug. <laughs> oh my god. Chris just sent me a, I guess, official art for LeChonk. <laughs> nice. That's what the trade looks like. Man, and I'm so happy about Colossal. Love Colossal. Guy. That's like the worst fucking Pokemon design ever, this guy. Gengar. That thing. Bag on Larvitar trade. Yeah, let's go. I'm assuming exclusives per game. Those two. That's usually how they do that with those two, right? Let's get another look at these legendaries. Look at the, the 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 scales and stuff. Why are their necks like that? Why do their necks look like a fucking wheel? I don't know. There's fucking the the two bosses from Monster Hunter right here. Uh, very squished faces. Okay, so that guy's all 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 natural dragony with little feathery things and whatnot. This guy's like a fucking robot machine with fucking jet engines. He's he's got robot eyes. Look at that. He's got pixel eyes. I just realized his eyes are like screens. Was that a fucking man-made legendary? Okay. Which one, which, 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 uh, which legendary do you like more? What do you think their types are? I wanna, I wanna say the one, like, I wanna say the fucking robot guy would be, like, electric steel, but that seems a little too obvious. And then also, the, so they're not gonna, then there'd have to be dragon in there, right? Like, usually, the, the end, if there's, like, a dragon-y type of legendary, they put dragon type in there. What if electric dragon? What, didn't they do that, uh, in Gen 5? I mean, not that they couldn't do it again. Um, fucking Reshiram and Zekrom, one of them. Wasn't, like, Fire Dragon and Electric Dragon or something? Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I, wanna, I almost want to say the guy on the left looks like fighting or something. Ground Dragon and Electric... Ooh! Love ground type, my favorite type. Um, I don't... I do love robots. You could probably get... Nah, do you think you can get both in the game? Probably not, actually, because in Sword and Shield you couldn't get both of them, right? Oh, they, it's always fucking weird how they do it. Uh, I was assuming Scarlet, because I kind of like the, the color Scarlet better, but, uh... Uh, I feel like I like the Robo Legendary. Psychic Dragon? I don't know. But you never know. The, the, the fucking... The types of the choose Legendary is always so random. Um, yeah, I kind of like Robo Guy, but I do like the color Scarlet better than Violet, so it's kind of hard to say, you know? Why is his neck like that? Why are both their necks like that? <laughs> What's in there? Is that a fucking wheel sticking out of the, on the left? Like, I don't understand. The Hot Wheels looking motherfucker? Like, <laughs> okay... And then with like the, 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 the headdress there, what's going on with that? Maybe is it could it be flying? Could it be flying with the feathers and shit? I don't know. But look this guy's got fucking electricity coming off of him. And he's a robot, so I feel like that would make sense. Um I'll just, I'll just have it put on quiet and just just see anything I might have missed real quick. Look at how fucking low res that house is in the background. Um but I guess it doesn't really matter. Like, we really need a, a, higher, a, a more powerful switch. Is that motherfucking Stonehenge back there? What is that? <laughs> no, it looks like it, like a, some ruins of a house or a building or something. A broken down fort. What is this TV? What is this TV from from 2009? <laughs> Look at that bezel though. Okay, these are the these are the professors. Y'all fucking or what? <laughs> Look at that. Look at that. very animated. Look at the little little moving ears and such. 
like the, the cries. Like the, I like the cries, nice. Who's this person? I can't get over the fucking fake Pikachu. You don't like robots? I'll help you pack. New evolution this game, maybe? Nah. Maybe. Wait, okay, hold on. Now I see what you're saying. Why, why is Quaxley fucking huge compared to these little squirts? And what I like big the fuck? Why is this so small? Is this small? Is this Foy Coco too. You think Foy Coco would have a little meat on his bones here? But look at Quaxley, absolute unit, Quaxley. His fucking uh Zachary Michael hair is taken is like half of his half of his body. Okay, look at these customizations. Does any of them include not a fucking collar and tie? No, of course not. Does this, is that just gonna be throughout the whole game stuck with a collar and a tie? Hmm. Yeah, so I guess the, the Pokemon Center is just like this little... This little kiosk thing that's just out in the wild so you can just, you know, you know, too far from it. You don't have to stop your adventure to go heal up. When you have to solve algebra at 9 a.m. but catch a legendary dragon at noon. So true. The fucking, I can't with the, he's running and the ties swinging back and forth. What a dweeb. LeChonk! Look at how he walks! Why'd they make him walk like that? Look at LeChonk! This motherfucker can barely move! He's a real chonk! Thanks for animating attacks, I really appreciate that. Oh my god, these Pokemon are so fucking small. Okay. What is it with what are these like cameras? <laughs> these free cameras. Just for the trailer, I guess. I wonder if there's like they could do any like rideable Pokemon or whatever for traversing the open areas like they did for uh, Legends Arceus. What is this? What is this part? That's a stadium. Oh, I guess it's kinda like different thing little little things that are out there uh, that are outside of cities that you can go to or something yes that's fuck you my lechonk walks completely fine more mounts please at least one okay, i got to i got to i got to analyze these look at those feet Look at those jet engines. Look at those little hands with the little pads in them. This dude's just got fucking jet engines for legs. And they why do they face that? Can you like turn them and fly around? Is that how that works? Okay, I mean it's cool. This to be honest with you, this one a little phallic, in my opinion, a little phallic. Um, but other than that, cool. Big feathers on this sucker right here. Big little eyebrows. Um, weirdly specific headdress feather thing here. Okay. Interesting. Forgot today. Chest so puffed. Yeah, it's gotta be like a wheel in there or something, right? Like, that's, like, you good? You'll, you swallow something? Like... What's going on there? Uh, this guy's got little T-Rex arms. Couldn't even scratch the top of his head if he wanted to. Uh, yeah. Yeah, this guy's got some fucking muscles on him. Uh, I wonder what their models in-game actually look like, though. Probably closer to, like, the, the 2D artwork. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. Take a look at this this cover art again. Um, yeah, I, I I just can't say enough how much I prefer this to like just slapping the 3D model on the cover. I, I'd much rather have the drawn thing. It looks way cooler. Um, I don't know if I'm even gonna be able to get it, the physical copy, because I I don't know if I'll be able to wait. Might have to just get it at midnight. Maybe we'll do. Maybe it'll, there'll be a midnight release for it at a GameStop. That would be a whole mess. 
but I'll, I guess I'll check on that uh, with the end of the year when this comes out. Jet Scream and Optimus Prime suck it. Weevil in the game? Because if not, then I, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just happy we got Colossal in there. But now the next thing is Golem going to be in the game. I feel like usual. I feel like it's kind of a guarantee because he's one of the original um, trade evolutions. And they always seem to throw all of those in there. You got your Geodudes, you got your Machops, you got your Gastlys, you got your Abras, usually. Usually that's a pretty safe bet for the Pokemon games, but uh, we'll see. Uh, I really wish they could still put all the Pokemon in every game, but uh, they don't want to do that anymore. So uh, I'm, 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 too, uh, I'm too tired of uh, arguing for it. Really cool color scheme on this fella. The Scarlet and the, the, the blue and the little, the little pinky thing here. Pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool, pretty cool. Uh, this guy, I don't, I don't really get it. I don't really get the design a whole lot, but... Cool. What is this? What's that little bit down here? Oh, oh, there are little, little feet attached to the jet engines. Just little claws coming out of the jet engines. I'm not really sure. Maybe it transforms. Maybe they bu hold on, hold on. Are they transformers? Does the guy on the left turn into a motorcycle? <laughs> or a unicycle maybe? Hold on. What if what if you can ride them around the the, the like wild area? Oh my god. What <laughs> What if the end of the game you hop on your fucking legendary <laughs> Just fucking, oh my god. That would be so cool. That would be so cool. You get to just ride around the fields and shit on your fucking legendary Pokemon motorcycle. And an e-bike. Yeah, yeah this, guy, this guy runs on gas. Diesel. <laughs> oh man, that's pretty cool. Hold on. Could be onto something here, because this looks like a wheel. That looks like some treads. Okay, hold on. I think we're onto something here. I like the scaly uh, background on there. Yeah, it's got. That's got to be it, right? That's got to be it. Look at. He looks like a fucking motorcycle. You you squat your gooch right there. That becomes the seat, right? <laughs> Ride me. We must go. <laughs> They look like Digimon. I see what you're saying. Okay, it's gotta, that's gotta be it. This has gotta be it. This guy's a fucking one wheel, and this guy's a jet engine. That's got, look at, they, they're, he's, he's like assuming the position, like, like, hop on, brother. That's gotta be it. How could it not be that? Look. And look, look, this guy's a fucking Harley Davidson. The fuck, the, the thing like this. <laughs> you can hold on to his eyebrows. Look at that. We've cracked the code, everybody. <laughs> and this is like a sport bike guy. You like lean forward on him, you know? You know, like those ones. Oh my God. That's it. Ah. Yes, yes, yes. Exactly that. Is this guy you're riding like, like this? The other guy, you're like, sorry. The other guy, you're like, leaning forward like meow. you know we've we've solved the mystery everybody we've solved it very cool and then you go really super f then you beat the game and then you go really super fast around the uh or they could imagine they switch it up on you it's like boom you get the legendaries right at the beginning of the game but they can't battle it but you ride them around or something that would be kind of stupid that that don't i don't think that'll be it uh, <laughs> a hog and a crotch rocket yeah yeah Sure. <laughs> uh, anyway, cover art looks good. The Pokemon they showed look cool. Lechonk, great design right there. Digital pre-order. I wonder if they like. Uh, if I was going to the eShop, if they um, tell you like what you get if you pre-order. Hope Lechonk evolves into Lethic. Nice. I bet you do. Bet you do. Oh, I don't have my Switch on me to check the eShop. Okay, nothing yet about like any kind of pre-order bonus or anything like that. Okay. Cool. Okay, so that was that was better. That was better than uh, I thought. The the models look cool. It looks like they did some some work with like texture and some shading or whatever. Thank God. Um, massive duckling. Yeah. Uh, and it's cool that they're gonna have some form of co-op. Hopefully that is actually decent. Although I feel like any kind of online play never. Really 
<laughs> works out that well for uh, Pokemon Company, but we'll see. Maybe they're finally changing it up. Pumped about the open areas. I'm glad we cracked the code on the legendaries. And uh, that's, uh, that's it. I've analyzed this three minute video enough, I think. And I'm gonna be on later. Uh, at noon, we're gonna be watching the new Sonic Frontiers gameplay that's dropping. <laughs>